Yo, what is going on everyone? Welcome, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kathleen and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new reaction. So in today's video, we're going to be checking out Jisoo's short documentary film and honestly, I'm both excited and nervous for this video. The only other documentary film that I've checked out so far is Lisa's and that video, I mean it was just a roller coaster of emotions but it was honestly such a good documentary and it was really well put together. I honestly learned a lot from it so I'm expecting the same with Jisoo's and this is exactly what I want. I want to get to know all of them individually as well as as a group. I feel like it's so important because yes, their music is great but so are they. They're literally queens like literally. Literally, these four girls are queens. The only thing that I'm not excited for is probably the deep parts. Like, I feel like it's definitely gonna get deep. It's a documentary. Lisa had a whole section in hers where it was like really focused on the hate comments and all that kind of stuff. And all I'm gonna say is I am sensitive to that stuff. So if y'all see me cry, just pretend that you didn't. But alright guys, most importantly, I'm gonna get to know more of Jisoo, which I can't wait for. So without further ado, this is Jisoo's short documentary film. Let's check it out. Alright, here we go, queen. This is all about you, Kim Jisoo. Get it, girl. Look at her performance. Oh, that look at the camera. She's so beautiful. She felt like she wasn't ready. The talented visual. More than a visual, but yeah. 2011. I mean, can you imagine debuting? Of course you're gonna be nervous. She she brought way more than looks, although she is a queen. Girl, I love I love Jisoo man. Aw, that right there. Being the oldest in the group is hard. Of course, she's really gonna have to take on that role as like the responsible one, the one in charge type of thing. Like not the leader, but the one that just kind of looks after the rest of the members. That right there would be challenging on its own because being as big as they are and having to deal with so much more, as in being in public, dealing with hate comments, dealing with daily struggles, and so much more as a celebrity. I honestly respect Jisoo so much for saying that and from so much that I've heard. I've heard how well that she takes care of the girls and it's honestly amazing that she took on that role. Just a lot of respect for that and for so much much more. Aww. That's the main thing, girl. Like, just do your best. Jisoo got a lot of hate. Aw, oh, here we go, man. She looks so awkward in dancing. Jisoo can't sing. I can't see any talents in her. Jisoo just a visual. Jisoo has no talent. Y'all, are you okay? Like, are people okay? People that leave these comments, you got nothing better to do, man. Like, you're clearly blind and deaf because Jisoo can't sing. For the people that think that Jisoo can't sing, like, I honestly am curious to know who you guys think can actually sing. Like, the people that run with auto-tune or, like, I'm sorry, but that got me messed up. Like, I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry. I'm not even a mean person, but, like, if you're gonna be mean to someone that really doesn't deserve it, like, I'm just so against that, man. I'm so against hate in general, like, there's just no need. It's literally so unnecessary and it's not true at all. This world just needs more positivity, y'all. Like, I'm about to throw this can at y'all. Like, not y'all, but the haters. I don't even know who put this can here. Like, I'm glad that it was empty. These people hurt my head and honestly, it hurts my heart to see Jisoo crying right here. Like, whether or not that's actually her reacting to these comments or just a scene from, like, Snowdrop or something, I don't care. That's messed up. Jisoo has a beautiful voice. She kills it with dancing. Like, I don't know if y'all saw my TikTok edits video, but I'm gonna talk about that specifically, okay? She was riding on the floor. Like, I tried that. Y'all, I would literally look like someone threw a potato at the ground and was just like kind of bouncing there doing nothing, okay? I'm not a dancer though. She, on the other hand, kills it. I, you know what? I'm gonna stop even wasting my breath. No one talks to my Jisoo like that. No one talks to Black Pink like that. <sighs> I'm not even gonna pay any. Mm -mm. I hate her already. Like. Why you don't let her pass easily if she had no talent, knowing that YG always makes the best decision on the final product. Y'all, read it a million times because 100%. Okay, number one, I'm not talking just about YG's judgment because my judgment, anyone with good taste, like, come on. To see how much hate that she receives honestly kills me, man. Like, she doesn't deserve it. None of them do. No one does. Like, I just hate hate. Like, y'all get me heated, but also I'm about to cry, so. Man, Jisoo don't deserve any of that. Chill. Chill. She didn't care about the hate? Hold on, I need to make sure that's what that said because otherwise she didn't even care about the hate comments. Okay, great. Oh my god, why did I almost start crying over that? 
People who will dislike me will dislike me. People who will like me will like me. Girl, you better make me cry just from that. Screw the hate comments. I'm gonna cry because of how great she is. comments honestly got me more mad than upset but her saying all that right there just hit me right here like I don't even know after that I just have a whole lot more respect for Jisoo like I didn't even know that was possible that was honestly refreshing to hear because everyone receives hate comments and it sucks but hearing that from Jisoo hearing that from an idol someone that you look up to someone that you just love honestly hits different to be able to have that outlook and just that level of maturity is amazing it was just extremely beautiful and it was 100% facts I know a lot of people can relate and take that as advice and I personally can for sure hearing that from her like I know I'll never forget it people that like you're gonna like you people that aren't aren't and like people that are gonna hate are gonna hate at the end of the day like <laughs> Kim Jisoo y'all they need to get lost man That's messed up, man. Wait, wait, what? OT1 Stan insult Jisoo for not speaking English. I just don't get people, man. Like, I don't know where this is at. She's probably somewhere in like America or something, I'm assuming. It'd be one thing if she was like rude about it or like, no, I don't want to speak English. I don't care for English and all that kind of stuff. But she's not. English is honestly a complicated language. Not the hardest, probably, but for someone that's not as familiar with speaking English, like, it's gonna be hard. And especially if she's on a show and like, what if she messes up in English and says something like insulting or something that offends someone by mistake, like, not meaning to? People honestly just stress me out. Like, just please, like, Use this thing that God gave y'all. Like, please. Okay, I'm sorry, but honesty is the best policy, so. It is what it is, man. That's so sad, man. Like. I hate that. I hate when people compare each other. Like, I get this in my comments. Mmm. Can't dance. Oh my god, man. <sighs> she is. Every time that I react to Blackpink or even her Vogue interview, like she is just so full of energy and she is just like so bubbly in a way. Like she's just always smiling and she just gives you life. You just get 100% positive vibes from Jisoo and uh, so much more. Like when she dances, I told y'all already, like it kills me. But those iconic moments with Jisoo as well, like I will never forget during the How You Like That Making film when she yelled out dance. She's just amazing all around. Oh, I would never think that Jisoo would be like cold or something. There you go, Jisoo. You'll be a comedian at some point. Oh yes, it showed so much during the Vogue interview. That's so cute. Y'all, we love her just as much, if not more. Like, come on. I love that though. I love how positive she is and just spreads love. I love when I see like celebrities give back to the fans. Like, not like give something away, just like love and appreciation. She's just like caring, just in general, with everyone.
girl. You are enough. Like, you make us happy with that other thing. Just because it said that, like, have y'all ever been up and just had your Weverse notifications literally popping off from Jisoo? Like, she is so great with interacting with us blinks. Like, it honestly makes me so happy every time I see it because it just shows how much she cares. Aww. <sighs> no, we need to protect her at all costs. We're literally thankful for her. Like, stop. Don't go to coffee. Let's see each other soon. I'll come again to see Blinks. Man, I love her. Like, I literally wish I could express in words how much I love Jisoo. Like, she is more than just a queen, man. I can't wait until their comeback, though. Let's see each other soon. Yes. <sighs> Y'all, we don't deserve her. <laughs> I love this girl. YG mistreating her, huh? Y'all a fool if you mistreat her and the rest of the members. Wow, so in my previous reactions, I've actually talked about noticing Jisoo not on screen as much as the other members. Seeing it in actual writing is messed up. It should be equal, but I know it's hard, obviously, with four members, but still. Man, it must be hard to be like under a contract and having to deal with so much of like rules. I mean, it's a given, but like they're also adults, so I don't know. I don't know how hard the rules and everything is though, like. I mean, come to think that she can get those CF deals. She was still training and now she's a big star. Hey, yo, YG. No brands. Okay, is this video old? Jisoo's offered something before and YG turned it down without Jisoo's. Whoa. Yo! Okay, wait, I'm a little confused. When's this video from? July 15, 2021. That was not even that long ago. That's so messed up on YG's part and the fact that she had to deal with that. I mean, she is the queen of Dior now though. So that's why I'm a little confused at this. A shampoo. Maybe they're talking about, oh, just like other sponsorships maybe? A shampoo. Why would they shut her down though? Right, this right here, yes, 100% that I can speak on. The rest of the sponsorships and being turned down by YG, I never heard about before. That's so messed up in so many ways. I don't know if I missed it or if they said this. But if that's the case, was Jisoo the only member that was denied? Like, if the other members were able to sign with different brands and all that kind of stuff, that's just extremely wrong of YG and just super unfair. As for having no solo content, 100%. I talked about this in the Vogue interview as well, that I want more things to react to by Jisoo. Then I was recommended this, so shout out to y'all. I'm crossing my fingers that Jisoo does have her solo this year. I know she already confirmed it, but I really hope that they just go through with it. She honestly deserves all the love in the world and I hear that she was being mistreated by YG. She doesn't deserve that at all and they don't deserve her to be honest. If that's like a fact. I 
I've been saying that. I wonder why she hasn't opened up a YouTube channel. Like, maybe she's just not into that, though. I know that, like, she's featured in others. that i heard how much she helped her learn korean oh my god don't mind me y'all i'm literally tearing up i heard how helpful she was with the members and i'm sure that they're teaching her english and doing everything like vice versa but i just love to see this honestly it touches my heart because they are so sweet and so pure like it just shows on them that's definitely the big reason of how i got hooked to blackpink <laughs> uh -huh. i love that they care for each other so oh she's feeding her dude Oh, I love this man. Like, they wouldn't be black pink without each other. Like, I love how they take care of each other and keep each other lifted and just are so good with each other. Because they wouldn't be as strong as they are if they weren't. I think we love her the most, to be honest. Like, yes, I love the fact that she's like so humble and like so genuine. amazing guys like this is such a beautiful documentary film I'm feeling all types of ways but most of all I'm feeling so proud of her it's one thing to be an amazing artist and amazing idol but it's another to be an all-around amazing human like Jisoo is just that she is multi-talented she's more than just the visuals she can sing she can dance she's yes of course very very beautiful she also has a heart of gold like her personality is just amazing and it shines through to be honest that alone means way more to me than her visuals or how well that she can sing the fact that she has an amazing personality that she takes care of the members and has that type of respect responsibility and maturity that speaks way louder than how someone looks she's just so humble and has a lot of respect and i have a lot of respect for her i'm honestly so glad that i finally watched this documentary because i thought that i had a lot of respect for jisoo already after this i seriously have a lot of respect for her she is the definition of a queen her mentality i just love her mindset i'm literally gonna watch this video over and over because it was just beautiful she was speaking nothing but facts and honestly this right here changed the game for me and honestly i look up to her after this like seriously whoever's gonna like you is gonna like you whoever's gonna hate is gonna hate and i'm I'm gonna write that on my wall right now because I need to wake up to that literally every day. Kim Jisoo, y'all. See, people like Jisoo, now this is who you should look up to. I just love her so much, man, and she is just so strong. Literally, thank you, Queen, for all that you do, and you will always be appreciated on this channel. But all right, guys, I'm gonna wrap up the video there. If you did enjoy, be sure to smash that like button for me. Leave me a comment down below what you wanna see me react to next. And if you're not already subscribed, be sure to hit the subscribe button down below and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss out on future Blackpink reactions. And other than that, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Peace.